of the Black Age when Merlo stocked the lands of Ferelden in numbers that kept every farm holder indoors and a hound on every doorstep. Powerful Arl of the Alamari people stood and declared. Ooh, that's cool. Ew. That's interesting. It tells the story of how werewolves came to be, I guess. Do we have a rogue in the party? <clears throat> well, that's unlikely as we know. Well, I don't know. I didn't mean to do that, but oh well. You think so? Not well, I don't know. I mean, maybe this is why I should have made him a rogue, but somewhat a rogue. But no. All my characters have been mages. Because they're cool. Oh well. Oh no, what are you doing? Bethany! Oh my god, she is dead. Go. Does anybody have revive? Yeah, she's dead. I'm sorry, mistress. Your daughter is gone. No. These things will not take Bethany. <laughs> she died bravely. Bethany risked her life to save us. I don't want a hero. I want my daughter. How could you let her charge off like that? Oh, my poor little what girl. The what? It wasn't my Sweet. fault. If we stand here weeping, the Darkspawn will take the rest of us too. Allow me to commend your daughter's soul to the Maker, mistress. Ashes we were, and ashes we become. Maker, give this young woman a place at your side. Let us take comfort in the peace she has found in eternity. I will never forget you, Bethany. At least she won't be alone. At least father will have company now. That's that's not what I meant. Oh no. That's not what I meant. Flames. We're too late. I feel like a terrible person. I will not die today. Yeah. No end to them. Well, I guess we're screwed. Is that the archdemon? Is that Plymouth? Oh, that's Plymouth. Oh, is that Plymouth? That's love. Is she purple? <laughs> I just saw a freaking beam about trying to find Plymouth at level 9 and I'm like, yeah, 
It's really hard. This just happens a lot if you try. Ooh, I love her armor. See, I had a mod for Dragon Age Origins where she was supposed to wear like armor like that, but she it it just never worked. The mod never worked. But then I realized well, I'm glad it didn't work. Because um I'm glad it didn't work because it kind of makes sense that Lucia's just pretending to be this old lady and then she looks like this the wild, for the rest of the game. But now it seems they arrive in hordes. Well, thanks for saving us. I don't know what we would have done if you hadn't arrived. I do. You would have perished. You still may. If you wish to flee the Darkspawn, you should know you are heading in the wrong direction. So you're just going to leave us here? And why not? Because I spotted you're a nice. curious sight. A mighty ogre vanquished. Who could perform such a feat? It was the dude dying. My curiosity is sated, and you are safe for the moment. Is that not enough? Oh my god. Can I be a dragon? Oh my god, I love the purple choices. I'm just you, most of the time I'm gonna be picking the purple choices. You could show me that trick of yours. Yeah. That Can I be a dragon? <laughs> I dare say it is. Such a clever tongue for a mage. Tell me, clever child, how do you intend to outrun the Blight? We're going to Kirkwall, in the Free Marches. Yeah. Kirkwall? My, but that is quite the voyage you plan. So far, simply to flee the Darkspawn. Well, we have family there. Our home is gone, and we have nowhere else to go. I see. Hurtled into the chaos, you fight, and the world will shake before you. I love Lena. She's so awesome. Is it fate or chance? I can never decide. Both? It appears fortune smiles on us both today. I may be able to help you yet. Just like that? There must be a catch. <laughs> there is always a catch. Life is a catch. I suggest you catch it while you can. Should we even trust her? We don't even know what she is. I know what she is. The Witch of the Wilds. Some call me that. Also Flemeth. Asha Bellinar. An old hag who talks too much. <laughs> <laughs> Does it matter? I offer you this. I will get your group past the Horde in exchange for a simple delivery to a place not far out of your way. Would you do this for a Witch of the Wilds? Um, I mean... Why? Sure, why not? Roast a few more Darkspawn? I'll do anything you want. Yeah. Sadly, my charity is at an end. There is a clan of Dalish elves near the city of Kirkwall. Deliver this amulet to their keeper, Marathari. Do as she asks with it, and any debt between us is paid in full. Oh god, this is not going to be a Before I take past. you anywhere, however, there is another matter. Oh no, is he dying? Uh oh. No, leave him alone. What has been done to your man is within his blood already. You lie! Can't you just cure him? She's right, Aveline. I can feel the corruption inside me. Whoa. Wait, what corruption? What are you talking about? From the dark spawn. All that blood. I knew when it happened. And how much time before you? Not long now, if I am any judge. Well, then we cure him. There must be something we can do. The only cure I know of is to become a Grey Warden. <sighs> and they all die They're not here at the moment. moment. Not all, but the last are now beyond your reach. We're currently in Ostagar. <laughs> if 
we're in loathing right Emily, now. Listen to me. Oh. You can't ask me this. Oh. I won't. This sucks. She used to kill her best friend. Death. I can't. He's your husband, Emma. That's her husband? Oh my god. Oh, this is a thousand times worse. Be strong. My love. This sucks. Oh, God. Without an end, there can be no peace. Wrong time, Plymouth. It gets no easier. Your struggles have only just begun. Fleming. I thought that yep. might interest you. You expect me to believe a myth swooped out of the wild to save the champion? Yes. Oh, come now, Seeker. Do I need to recite the tale of the Warden as well? No. Perhaps I shouldn't be surprised to hear of her involvement. I liked my version better, too. What else aren't you telling me, then? Did she send someone with the champion? In a matter of speaking. So it's true. Continue. But if you tell me they all flew to Kirkwall on a dragon... Nothing so fanciful, I assure you. The witch kept her word and got them to Guaran, where they took ship. They sailed north across the waking sea, lashed by terrible storms. Two weeks they spent in that dark hold, packed in with the fearful and the desperate. And then they saw it. Kirkwall, the city of chains. Long ago it was part of the Imperium, slaves coming from far and by to work the quarries. Now, it's a free city, but I use the word loosely. Sail through those black cliffs and you'll see what the slaves of old saw. The gallows, welcoming you. Sounds lovely. That's where their ship landed, with all the rest. Okay. Well, we live here. Excuse me, we live here. Get back to the crowd, you lot. But we Trying live here. Trying to bully your way through won't get you into Kirkwall any faster. But you do intend to let us in. <laughs> we have enough poor of our own in the free marches. We don't need you refugees piling up here like a midden's heap. Well... Then... Who do I need to talk to again? There must Sorry. be someone in charge I can speak with. Yes, yes, always the same story. You want in, talk to Captain Yule. I'm just here to keep you refuse from climbing the walls. Okay, fine. Where's this Captain dude? Tell me. How did your family Keep escape murdering? Almost everyone who hadn't fled. My older sister. I'm if she not wasn't back with us, on this ship. I don't think we'd be here. But you seem quite skilled as well. I'm not my sister. Oh, did I not tell you to keep the rabble out of here? Chatting with you. God. Like, I get to know people. What do you want? Let us through, you flaming blighter. We're not staying in this pit. You're rude. Then get back on your ship and leave. Kirkwall has no more room for refugees. The ship's already gone. We've paid good coin to get here. 
He looks you like he has dark spawn poisoning. The city is full. Well, it's a big city. Surely there's a bit of extra room for the pretty people. I find keeping my neck away from Knight Commander Meredith Blade far more attractive than any of you. We've been letting you Ferelden's in for months. You're too late. There's no more room. But we've got family here. I've heard claims like that a thousand times already, trust me. We'll find some ships to take you all back to Ferelden eventually. Until then, you stay here. If you find our uncle, Gamlin Amel, you might just have a few less refugees bothering you. Gamlin? I know that name. Yeah. He's a nobleman here in the city. Our family has an estate. A nobleman? The only Gamlin I know is a weasel who couldn't rub two coppers together. He comes back, I'll bring you to him. But I don't have time to... What? You're gonna let them through? Yeah. I didn't say anything about it. We've been here for four days. They just got here. He has dark spawn poisoning. We're carving our <laughs> way out of here. Men? Uh, no. Something my dwarf would do. I feel bad for my mom. She's like, my goodness, this doctor is so violent. Are you all right? I am. No thanks to you. Where is everyone? Go find them. I want this kept under control. You have my thanks. Look, I can't get you into the city. It's not my decision. But I'll find your uncle and bring him here. Okay. Just be here. It's been three days. This waiting has to oh my end. God. It's been three days. I'm sure it won't be much longer. Gamlin must still be looking for us. And if he's not, don't look now, but I think that's our man. Sup, unlike the years. Damn girl, the years haven't been kind to you. Gamlin. Let me say up front, I wasn't expecting this. The blight, your husband, dead. I Why do you have to mention that? You'd pretty much be Ferelden for life. Oh, Gamlin, we came too late. My darling Bethany didn't make it. I'm dressed to guide her. Oh, make her save me. Leandra, don't drop this on me here. I don't even know if I can help you get in. What if I asked nicely? Would it help if I said you were my favorite uncle? <laughs> it would make me feel better, but that's about it. I was hoping to grease some palms, but the Knight Commander's been cracking down. We're gonna need more grease. But what about the estate? Surely Father left something when he died? Right, uh, about the estate. It's, um, gone. To settle a debt. I've been meaning to write you. Then there's no hope. N not quite. I know some people who might help. If you're not too delicate about the company you keep. Why don't we just leave? Do we need to stay in Kirkwall? And let's go to another city. This was my home. I can't believe they won't let me come back. I'm so rude to Every this city lady. On the coast's been hip deep in <clears throat> since the blight. So rude. You could try your luck further in the nice suppose, to but it won't be easy. We're not putting mother through that. We came here. We're staying here. Fine. Let's what do you have in mind? 
I talked to my contacts, and I found some people who might be willing to pay your way into the city. The catch is, you and your brother will have to work off the debt. For a year. A year? A year? <laughs> it's the best I could do. Trust me when I say a bunch of refugees won't get a better option anywhere else. Fine, what's a year? I'm sure we'll be free and clear before we know it. I managed to convince my contacts to come to the gallows to meet you personally. Miran heads up the mercenary company, the Red Iron. They're looking for recruits. A Fenril. I guess you might call her a smuggler. Either one of them can help you. All you need to do is find them in the courtyard and convince them you're worth the trouble. What do you think, Carver? What do you think about this, Carver? What can I say? Better here than nowhere. <laughs> 